I, I'm a teacher and I have two teenage boys. Believe me, I know how to yell. I appreciate you guys allowing me to go first. As you said, my, our youngest has his senior prom tonight. And so we were trying to snap pictures real quickly and they're all sweating. And so they ran to eat dinner. So I'm going to try to finish up with the photos after. So I really appreciate your letting, allowing me to do this and get out. Um, my name is Tara Boatwright Parker. I'm married to Brian Parker. He's the controller at Paper Mill in Clyville. I see some Paper Mill ladies and gentlemen out here. Uh, we live in um, Hayhira off of Shiloh. We have two sons. Our oldest son, Taylor Parker, graduated this past May uh, from Lowndes High School. He's an honor graduate. He had eight uh, college courses finished through the dual enrollment program. He's attending VSU. Our youngest son, Christian Parker, is a senior at Lowndes High School, played football. He's our star student this year and uh, current valedictorian. So Lord willing, we'll see how those uh, <laughs> finals go. Um, my husband and I have been married for 22 years and um, we met at Valhalla State University where I have two degrees. One is in public relations, my master's is in administration, and I have spent my entire life in, in education. My parents are retired teachers. Uh, I teach at Valhalla State University part-time. My current class that I teach mostly is political science, American government. And this is my first venture into this side of politics. It's been interesting. It's been a great learning curve. And I appreciate Mark and Eric. Um, they've been gentle and kind. And this has been a wonderful process. Uh, I really wish we could do question and answer because what I really want to say is I have three ideas. But my number one idea is I just want to hear from our voters and our community. I believe that the board should truly represent the constituents, the kids, the teachers. Um, as an educator, I hope that I would be able to offer a little bit of personal insight, but it really is not about my personal opinions. Um, it's about what our constituents want to see done. Uh, in that regard, I would like to see us open up our meetings and maybe use technology, have them online, where our parents and teachers could maybe comment real time and I realized that would take extra time at a board meeting, so someone would have to kind of screen it, but maybe we could have some interaction because I would like to see um, increased involvement, really and truly, uh, in the meetings and in ideas. The second thing that I would like to see is that we focus on getting some of the policies and the paperwork and the procedures out of the classroom. As an educator, I can tell you if you would just let me walk in there and let me spend my time and energy teaching would be wonderful. I believe that we strap our educators down with so much red tape and we're going to have a workshop and we're going to learn how to teach better and then we're going to write a report about how we're going to teach it and what we're going to teach and then we're going to prove to you that we taught it. If you just let us teach, um, most of us got into that because that's what our, we're passionate about and uh, I see that as really and truly a stumbling block for educators. So to the extent that the local board has the ability to reduce a lot of that, I would like to see us um, allow our teachers to spend their time and energy on teaching. And I've just lost my third thing. What's my third thing? Here, I'll just wing it. Uh, <laughs> I believe that what's important to you is where you put your resources, where you put your time, your energy, your money, and I promise you I can show you my bank statements for the last 15 years, 20 years. My time and my energy, my resources have all been about kids. Not just my kids, community kids. Uh, I do volunteer with a lot of uh, our local women and children in the shelter and Boys and Girls Club. I, I don't want you to hear about me. I just want you to know that if you want to look inside and see what's important to someone, look and see what they're doing when no one's looking. And people who've seen me, I hope, will tell you when nobody's looking, I spend time working with our kids, and I'm going to do that, you know, whether anyone votes or not, or, and I hope you all will vote, and it looks like most of you are running, so I guess you're going to vote. So, um, uh, I'm assuming we're not taking questions, so I'm going to close there, unless there's anything else I didn't say. Thank you again. I appreciate you guys for letting me do this, and I'm going to run go finish up prom pictures. And uh, I'll see you all later. Okay, thanks. <laughs>